Jills is making tacos for dinner and bought some beef and chicken. At the store, he bought twice as much beef as chicken. The chicken cost $1.85 per pound, and the beef cost $3.70 per pound. Before sales tax, Jill spent a total of $12.95 on beef and chicken. The system of equations below represents the pounds of chicken, X, and the pounds of beef, Y, that Jill's purchased. Part A, use the ray tool to graph the system of equations on the coordinate plane. We'll go over to Desmos and graph it. Um, I am not going to graph it because I have trouble doing that on my iPad. And then part B, use the point tool to select the approximate pounds of beef that Jill's purchased. One thing to notice here, once we get that graphed in Desmos, the approximate pounds of beef that Jill's purchased, remember beef is going to be a Y value. So we need to use that Y. But if we flip over here to Desmos and we type this in, we get Y equals to X. And then our 1.85x plus 3.7y equals $12.95. So what's a little bit harder on this one here, and actually the easy part, is going to this point right here and finding that... Um, we're going to have 1.4 pounds of chicken and 2.8 pounds of beef. Chicken is the X and beef is the Y. But getting these graphed here, again, I'm not going to graph them, but it, it's much easier to do with a mouse on the computer. But let's find a couple of points to use. So, for instance, on the green graph, we can go to 0, 0. And then we can also go to this point, maybe, and having trouble on that for whatever reason today. But this point right here is 1, 2. So I'm going to come over to my paper here, and the green graph was the first graph. So we've got 0, 0 that we can use for a point on our graph back in the program. And then the point one, two. Not quite as easy on the purplish line here, but I'm going to use this point here if I can get it, which is 3.5, 0, 3.5, and over here, which is 7, 0. So maybe in the end it's a little bit better. So 0, 3.5, and 7, zero. It might be nice if you could see them. So zero, zero, one, two from the green line, zero, three point five, and seven, zero from the purple line. And once again, what we've got here is where these two lines intersect means that we bought 1.4 pounds of chicken and 2.8 pounds of beef. And I'm going to write And now we can go back to the program. And again, what's going to happen is that you're going to draw those in. And then at the very bottom here, and you can't see it yet, but at the very bottom here, we had, we said 2.8 pounds of beef. So I'm going to hit the 2.75, which I don't think it will let me mark because... Um, I haven't drawn in the graph yet, but 2.75 is closer to 2.8 than 3 is, hence the reason why I marked that answer.